Hi everybody, Bill here with TurboDial. This video is going to walk through the different kind of phone calls you can make with TurboDial and demonstrate them. There are two fundamental call types with TurboDial. You can make a non-recorded call or you can make a recorded call. And then within each of those call types you have some options. So you can choose the number you want to call, of course, from the selector associated with the contact, or you can enter a number. You can choose the device you want to make your call from, such as your PC or Macintosh using a headset, or you can call from a phone. And lastly, you can choose the caller ID number that you want to display to the people that you're calling. So let's do a demonstration. Here I have an Infusionsoft contact listing screen in this panel, the larger screen on the right. Note also that in this Infusionsoft screen I got the turbo dial button associated with every contact because I have the TurboDial extension installed and the TurboDial linker extension is what places that there. It's really important that you have that extension installed. And of course then here's the TurboDial panel on the left. And right now it's focused on Alan Bradford. And you can see that Alan Bradford's phone numbers show up in TurboDial. And it's exactly the same numbers that are actually in the Infusionsoft account. And in Infusionsoft, in this account, the phone numbers have been designated according to the type and, and they are accurate. And so, for example, this one is Alan's mobile phone number, home, work, other, and work, right? And so you can see those similar designations here. So let's choose a number, and let's make a call to Alan. Phone is ringing. I'm going to go ahead and answer it because this phone rings right here next to me. And so now I've answered that call. I'll end the call, and now notice, if I go to Alan's contact record, I can open up his notes. And that right there is the note that was left behind by TurboDial stating that this call occurred. Now, let's go on to the next contact, Alice Bradley. And in this case, let's record the call that we're going to make. So I'm going to, rather than using the call button, I'm going to use the record button, which is right next to the call button. Phone's ringing. And now I'm going to answer it, testing one, two, three. I'm going to end that call. And now I'm going to go, let's take a look at Alice Bradley and look at her notes. And there I can see the turbo dial. We just made a call from the PC and it was recorded. If I open up that note, by the way, I can see more information about that. And if I look at the call data tab, I can see an actual link to that recording. In fact, I can play it if I like. Phone's ringing. And I'm going to answer it. Testing one, two, three. Okay. So that's how you can make a recorded call and a non-recorded call. Now, I can also make a call by entering the number that I want to call, rather than choosing one that's already on the contact record. By choosing enter number from that list, and by entering the number here manually using my keyboard, I can now make a call to that phone number directly. Notice that TurboDial does not assume that that is a call to Alice Bradley. And so it asks me, before it attaches a note to the contact record, if that's okay to do. Because if it is not a call to Alice Bradley, it wouldn't be appropriate to attach that note to the Alice Bradley contact record. There's some more choices here. In TurboDial, I can choose to call from this PC, which is the phone calls that I just demonstrated, or I can choose a different phone to call from that I previously configured. Now, where does this list of optional phone numbers come from that are shown here under the calling device? Well, it's all of my caller ID numbers. Whenever I register a caller ID, it will show up as a calling device. Also, any phone numbers I have purchased and acquired from Twilio, for example, using this tool, will also show up as a calling device. I can also add numbers directly into my calling device list using that tool. So let's choose this number here right there to be the number that we're going to call from. We're going to make our call to this phone number right here, and we're going to present that caller ID when we make the call. Now let me step through in advance what's going to happen before we make the call. TurboDial is going to first call the calling device, which is the number I'm going to call from. I'm going to answer the call. Once I do, TurboDial will say, now connecting, and then proceed to connect the call to the person that I'm calling, which is Alice Bradley, and it'll ring her number. 
both of these phones are present near me, so I'm going to be able to answer both of them, so you'll be able to hear both phones ringing. But just to reiterate, TurboDial first calls the calling device, I answer, and then it connects me to the person I'm calling. I'm going to start the call now. Calling the first number. Now connecting. It's now connecting to the next one. Next number is ringing. And now I've answered the second phone, and we're talking. So that's how I can make a call from a phone device in addition to just making calls from the PC. Now, the other thing I can ch change is I can choose which caller ID I want to display when I make a call. And I can choose any one that I have listed here. I can also add caller IDs or remove them from this list. Numbers that I have acquired from Twilio will automatically show up here as a caller ID. But if I want to add a caller ID, I will need to validate that it is a phone that I own, and TurboDial will walk me through those steps when I press the Add button. Okay, so now we've seen that we can call any number on the contact record for a contact. We can make a call without recording it, or we can make a call by recording it. We can make the call using this PC, or we can make the call from one of the phones that we've set up as a calling device. And we can choose which caller ID we want to display to the people we're calling. That's an overview of the different ways for making phone calls in TurboDial. Thanks, everybody. Happy phone calling.